Hey, Sasante Samuel here, your number one corner. We're here with Bring It Home Single Moms, and we're watching Unscripted. Innovation, creating positive vibration. In a position to give a helping hand. What is your destination? Next generation need education, not exploitation. The traditional American family. Spending quality time together, eating dinner, going for walks, and taking vacations has become a thing of the past. Families like these only exist on our favorite TV shows because realistically, 25% of homes in the U.S., the father is removed from the picture, leaving 9.9 .9 million single mothers. And when you go deeper into the inner cities, that number almost doubles. To help intercept and stop these numbers from going forward, it would call for someone who has experienced life as one of these statistics, which led to the inspiration of the Bring It Home Single Moms Asante Samuel Foundation. Well, the foundation is inspired through my mom to me, you know, just I'm doing this because of her and, and, and the way she didn't give up and she fought and didn't take no for an answer and, and make sure she provided whatever she could the best of to her abilities. That same passion and determination helped mold this future pro bowler into the man he is today. Making it to the NFL and being successful uh, just made me look back at our, our, my past and my childhood. When it was me, and my mom, my sister, you know, we grew up, you know, it was just us and it's all we had. And, you know, when we bounced around house to house made me realize if we'd have had that place that we call home and didn't have to bounce around and move, life could have been that much easier for us. With the problems that we have in society and with children, so much of it stems from the challenges that come from single family households. So we really felt as if we could get to the core of how we could really make a difference um, within society, within local communities, and use you know Asante's story and his passion and his celebrity in order to be able to really spark some, some more awareness on those individual challenges. We know their moms love them and they nurture them, but we need to be able to provide them an environment that they can be in, that their mothers feel safe and secure, and that they know that they're not bouncing from pillar to post. The Bring It Home single mom's mission starts from the ground up by building a solid foundation that will provide stability, structure, and safety along with the tools and resources that every single mother needs to raise her family. Bring it home single moms, it's basically we try to put single moms in a home, give them the stability, and now we're kind of branching out to start empowering them all over in you know, the foundation of what it takes to keep up that home. We've had great partners like Habitat for Humanity uh, who have a great process on, you know, being able to identify the most deserving of single moms and be able to help them. We were able to put two single moms, one in Miami and one in Philadelphia, in a home. And that's when we realized that we could do so much more of a benefit to empower these women on a more broad scale rather than just a home. They were asking questions and they needed counseling and guidance and mortgage and Insurance. The little things that we can do to give that stability is that extra time that their mom may have to be able to be in their child's life. So we're trying to teach them all the basic needs that you and I may take for granted, but it, it is, it's not for them, it's not first nature, it's not second nature, it's something that they need to be taught. So we're going to give them the tools to be able to do that. So when their children grow up, we've broken that chain and we've broken that cycle. Asante and his foundation not only empowers the lives of single mothers, but reaches out and gives back to the ones who never had a voice and are affected the most, the children. Once I shared this opportunity with the teachers, I asked them to select some students who would not be shy to talk with Asante, but who also came from single parent families. But more importantly, um, you were able to hear their voices, their stories, and that's what is so very important. I just feel something special relate, relating to me and him. I just feel a connection because he had, he had no father, I had no father. Well, having a Sante here, that was a great opportunity that most kids don't even get to meet him because 
well, he is a pro athlete, and he's just like me and other kids, only born with one parent. I told my stuff because maybe he could probably give me some advice to help with my mother and probably help me maybe become stronger when I get older. They want to interact with him and they feel like so inspired. They, they're like, can we touch you? Can you sign this? And, you know what I mean? It's just those little things that they'll take home and remember and hopefully somebody, one of them, anything can become something because of it. The conversation they had with Asante to talk about their dreams, to have a backup plan, they have been given some advice and counsel that I'm sure they may have heard it from others, but they heard it from Asante, so it's gonna be extra special. It's going to take them a long way. They'll never, ever forget this. Well, for my backup plan, I wanted to be an artist, but for my main plan, I want to be a photographer because my grandmother, she influenced that on me and I got inspired. We just talked about our cheerleading and what we're gonna be when we grow up. And what was our backup plan? And mine was, if I didn't be a famous singer, I would be a pediatrician. You know, just because the people they know have never had those dreams or don't have those same hopes, that if they work hard, they will still have the opportunity to have the, those things become a reality. You can't put a price on that. We can only hope that other great organizations become inspired and take a page out of the Bring It Home Single Mom Foundation playbook and get their celebrity athletes to put in the time where their name is to help dreams like these come true.